If you want to have your own logo completely for free, check out this episode. Hey guys, it's Nemanja and welcome to another fun episode. If you want to have your own logo for your company, for your business, for your YouTube channel, etc. And maybe you're just starting with that and you don't have enough money to pay for a professional designer or maybe you just don't want to pay for a professional designer, there is a solution for you and it's called Design Evo. Design Evo is a great website, actually online tool, where you can make your own logo or choose between thousands of already made presets and you can change them to suit your needs. And it's completely free with some limitations, which I will talk about a little bit later. So now let me show you how it works. Okay, first thing that you need to do is to go to designevo.com and this is a screen that you will see. Of course, there are some things down below too, you can check that out. But to start making a free logo, just go and click on make a free logo. It's simple as that. And this is a screen that you will see after you click on that make a free logo button. And as you can see guys, there are a bunch of predefined logos right here and you can choose between any of them and then you can change uh, logo color, you can change logo name, uh, slogan name, you can even remove some elements, add new ones, change the font, etc. I will show you that in a moment. Or you can go on the left side right here and choose between all of these categories. So for example, if you want to make some kind of business logo, go to business and finance category and you here need just to scroll down and find a logo that will suit your needs the best and then you can modify it. Or you can go to lifestyle for example or maybe if you want to create some kind of photography logo just go to art and entertainment and here you can choose any kind of photography logo that you like the best or you can even narrow the selection to see only certain types of logos so if i want to see only uh, types of uh, photography logos i can go here on the search bar and type photography okay and now i will see only photography type of logos this is really neat option right here Okay, now let's find the logo for my Imagine company and let me show you how you can modify it. For example, I have a company that makes fresh squeezed juice and I need a logo for it. So I will go to Design Evo and go straight for the search bar right here and type juice. Okay, and now let me show you what's on the menu. So we have some really nice logos right here. There are not a bunch of them because it's really narrow selection, but let me see. Let's choose this one. Why not? Now when I click on this logo, I will be prompt to enter logo name and slogan. So if I uh, don't know the logo name right now or the company name and the slogan, I can skip it and enter it later. But for example, my company is dealing with a fresh squeeze juice. So let's call it squeeze. Why not? So squeeze and let's type some kind of slogan. Let's type uh, something like uh, Good nutrition is our mission. This is really popular one. So, good nutrition is our mission, and just press get started. So we'll be redirected to another page, and this is what we have. As you can see, uh, there the, the 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 slogan it's too uh, big, so we will just click on it and just just move it down, shrinking down, or we can double click on that and go and press enter just to put it in another row and then we can go right here and just center it so this is one option and now i can make it bigger like this i can move the squeeze so you can see guys really straightforward you can just move the things left and right up and down center it to be you have those helper lines like in photoshop you have on the left side some some fonts so you can change the font for good nutrition maybe you can change the modern, traditional handwriting. Let me see something like like this. It's not so good like this. I don't like it. Uh, no. So I can go maybe to modern and choose something like this or this. This is not bad. And there are a bunch of those fonts. So you can just go and search what suits the best. So let's use this one. Let me see just this one. Not bad, but well, let's use this one why not so let's make it a little bit smaller and center it right here like this and now i don't like this color i don't like this uh, brownish color and this brownish color too so i can change the color i can click on this and go to the color at the top right here and i can pick one of the documents colors so those are colors in the documents or i can choose my own color here custom color or 
some solid colors that are already predefined here. So I'll choose the green. I like the green better. I can maybe make this bigger, squeeze, and then I can center this. Maybe make this bigger too, why not? So this is our document. We can do everything inside this square. So this is the squeeze one. And now I don't like this color. I will click on this icon and I have three colors here. First is that brownish color that I don't like. I can click and just change to any color that I like, but I don't like this. Maybe I like some gradient color so I can go down here and click on gradient and this is much better. It's for me, it's a little bit better than this brownish color. So I will click this and that's it. Of course, if I want to remove some elements like this row, I can go and remove it or I can just place it back or I can add a new element. So to add a new elements, go here, you can add the text, you can add the shape, you can add a background, transparent one, it's currently, but we can add some kind of color background if we like, just for a test. I don't like it, I like to use transparent one. Okay, and then we can add some kind of icon. So you can choose between maybe YouTube icon, there are crazy YouTube icons, maybe I have a YouTube channel and I want to choose something like that. So let's choose this one, right? Put it here change the color to red, like YouTube red, then I can make it smaller. For example, I, this is just to show you what you can do. And then you can type the text for your YouTube channel. For example, I want, uh, I want to add this like slogan and double to plot to edit. And my YouTube channel is squeeze, squeeze this company just for example, squeeze company and that's it. I can move it right here. And this is like, if I want to have this in my logo, but I don't want to have obviously this in my logo, I will just delete it, select and delete. This is just for example, to show what you can do. And if I'm satisfied with this, if that's what I want, I can go here on the preview button. So click on that and I will preview how this will look on a business card on this type of thing. So you can see on a computer screen on this kind of notebook, or on the shirt. I love how it fits on the shirt, on a wall, etc. So you can see a preview. That's a great addition. And then if you're done with this, you can save it. You can save it for later. You can try a few different logos and then compare. So you can save it or you can go and download it. So if I'm done with this, if this is something that I like, this is my future logo, I can download it. And then I have three options. I can download this for free, as I said at the beginning. There are some limitations. So limitations is that I can only download 500 by 500 pixels as a free option. So that's great for a web, for a YouTube site, for things like that. And it's on a white background or the background that you choose. So you cannot uh, download transparent logo. That's not an option. And that's it. If you want to pay 1999, you will have size up to 5000 pixels and you can download on transparent background you can uh, re-edit as many times as you want and download it again and uh, you have lifetime support and print ready logo for a little bit more money for 39.99 you have all those options plus you can download the vector files that's great addition and you can download the font files and you can even have copyright ownership so that's a great two for only $39.99. So that's much cheaper than to hire a designer to do that for you. Design Evo has a mobile app too, so both for Android and iOS devices. And if you want to create your logo on the go, this is an option for you. And uh, having a mobile app has one benefit, and that's that you can download some free logos with the transparent background. So check that out too. Okay, now let's talk about that giveaway that I mentioned at the beginning. I will be giving away 10 coupon codes and each of them is valuable for three custom logos, not in free, not in basic, but in plus options. So you will have all the benefits that you can get from Design Evo for three custom logos. You just need to create a logo and go to this final screen and choose the plus option, the most expensive one, and just make account with Facebook or anything you want and you will be redirected to this checkout page and just say have a coupon enter the coupon and you can download that for free so you can download three different logos okay but how to get those coupon codes well it's really simple for first 10 of you guys who leave down there in the comments design evo and your email address i will send a coupon code to that email address so just for first 10 of you guys 
Okay, guys, and that's it for today. Thank you for watching this episode and see you in the next one. Bye-bye.